Again, the deadline for the legislature and the governor to agree on a budget is tomorrow at midnight. Well, we just heard from the governor. Now the other side. Welcome, Republican House Speaker Kurt Dowd. Thank you so much for coming in. Good morning, Esme. Thanks for having me in. All right. I have to say, when I asked the governor if it was going to get it, things were going to get done by tomorrow, he said exactly what you said to me before the show, <laughs> that you're optimistic. I am optimistic. Uh, we've had uh, what I would call probably a, a breakthrough in the last uh, maybe 24 hours. Uh, the meetings have been really well. I think everyone understands that the clock is ticking, and if we are going to get this done on time, uh, that we need some real movement. And there has been over the, the course of the last 24 hours, so that's what gives me optimism. Okay, the devil's in the details. <laughs> what happened? Well, you know, I think... Uh, I, I always say the governor, you know, believes that he gains some leverage if he can push things till the end of session. And, you know, I think that's one of the flaws with, with uh, Washington. They don't have an end deadline that forces people to come together and compromise. Um, and, you know, Friday night we, we decided that we had to get these bills moving because it takes time to pass those bills. Uh, Saturday morning when we met with the governor, it was kind of a different tone. Everybody was uh, was uh, starting to talk about what the well, real well, final please, agreement looks like. Please so. share. <laughs> well, you know, I, obviously for us, our priorities have been tax relief. Uh, it has been transportation. Um, we did meet the governor halfway on the tax number. We think that's fair. Um, the governor said a couple of days ago he shouldn't have to go more than halfway. We kind of feel the same way. Um, so we think that's a fair number. Uh, we've got $300 million of road and bridge money out of the general fund. There will be more. In a, in a bonding bill if we can get the agreement on the bonding bill. Um, and, and then the other spending numbers just kind of have to fit in place. Uh, so we feel optimistic about that happening. All right. Uh, and obviously you're holding back, it seems, on some specifics because it's not obviously. a done deal yet. But, I mean, it, it's going to have to get done by tonight. I mean, it, realistically, it, it just really, to get everything printed and going it, it over. It really right? will. And there's a, there's a, uh, you know, there's a, a process where we need to get the bills printed and drafted. Right. And, and that takes time and to make sure that there's no errors and mistakes and, and people have time to read them. And we bring them out in conference committee and, and folks can read through them. Uh, so we really need to have those agreements by late this evening um, in order to pass everything out. I think you'll st we, we passed our first budget bill last night, the ag bill, where we had agreement. We're close on about three others, very, very close on about three others. You should see those by probably afternoon, um, moving through the House and the Senate, and the rest uh, overnight tonight and tomorrow during the day. All right. Is